Hold on. All right, this is, this is how you know you have green juice. Let me just give a real reaction to it. I mean, good, uh, golden juice. We'll call it golden juice. Thank you, Nikki. She just left to go get my car from California and uh, now start her new stay. And Venice Beach, we love you. Here you go. Let's try your juice. Uh, how is it? Can you can you feel that fire coming from my? Let me try it. Yeah, try Let me try it. it. Woo! Hooky wooky. <clears throat> That's good. Wow. <laughs> we should mix that with your green juice, then, and then we'll get really high. These on life. ladies have been going up to this mountain farm, picking fresh vegetables, greens, herbs. Ginger. I don't know if that's actually true, but they have. Yeah, ginger, oh, they grow ginger and turmeric up there. That's mm -hmm. what I'm talking about. This Rasta. is a little look into the the refrigerator of us. Um, Diana's the expert chef. She prepares meals for us on a nightly. She's wonderful mm -hmm. at that. Um, oh. And speaking of food, we're about to go chop down a banana. All right, I'll go tree. drink. I'll drink this green juice. Do they mix. Call it, do, question for you guys: Do you call it a banana tree or do you call it a banana bush? Uh, or a flower, flower, or a weed. All I know is you gotta chop down the whole thing to get the banana. So everybody. And allegedly, if you don't chop down the whole thing, they only grow one stock, and then they rob the other. They rob the neighbors of their nutrients. Mm. Let's get that machete. That's like the opposite of per permaculture. Should I just leave the camera on so we can uh, no, see? No, don't leave it on. No. That's what we gotta be good. At. These vlogs, apparently, the best way to do vlogs is to do real quick clips because people can't pay attention to long clips. So you want to feed into their ambitious, defiant, happy animal nature? Yes. Their attention dialed into a higher dimension? Alright. Are you cooking quinoa again? I'm always cooking quinoa. <laughs> Show you around our place. Yeah. Very importantly is this guy. His, fr his neighbor is still growing pretty good. It's a vlog. We capture everything that we do on camera for you. Come on. This is what it's like to be with us. Yeah, How does it feel to be with us? Aren't you having so much fun? So much, such hey, a blast. Look at van. Look how much attention I need. <laughs> look at our van, guys. I'm going to get attention pretty soon. <laughs> this is a van we've been renting from Maui Budget Rental Cars. Um, they're pretty cool guys. Tell us about the story uh, with your interaction with the guy. Yeah, I had to... Give me a machete too while we walk. I had to set straight because... Let's use the rusty one. Charges too much for a, a bad van. This is my surfboard. I bought it for $100. It's been surfing epic waves. Hukipa, double overhead, lefts, all lefts, baby. But who caught, who caught the bigger, badder waves than you? Uh, I don't know this guy on a foam board. <laughs> There's one guy out there. I think he was half Jewish, um, married to a princess. Hey, let me show you something before you do it. Well, before you give us a performance of the banana tree, I want to give a performance. All right. Here's Check out going. these leaves. <laughs> Have you ever seen leaves this big? Wow. Just for a little reference of how big they are. Wow, that's sweet. Good photo, bro. Wow. That's a big leaf. Have you done an Instagram shot like that yet? I'm going to have to do one. <laughs> that's, what, that's what this life is coming oh, to. Check out these rainbow eucalyptus trees. I'll, I'll give one more demonstration with that machete. Before. It doesn't count. If you're doing something that's fun, it doesn't count unless you post it on Instagram, YouTube, or Facebook. I hope you know that. And you probably know that. And if you have that. a machete in your hand and or if you're breathing air, it counts. But check out this invasive parasite of a bush that climbs up these rainbow eucalyptus trees that are like basically sucking, sucking the life force from these things, which they have some to share. But apparently that's only about a month old. All right, Timothy, you ready? Hey, yeah, but I need some uh, real quick attention. Okay. Um, <laughs> over here, this is my uh, gym. Actually, I've made a gym out of cement blocks. Watch this. It's not a cement block, some of these cement. You got L sits. Uh, this is my handstand block. It's pretty hard to. I have a feeling people might be losing interest. Hurry up. <laughs> this is now a 2 minute and 22 second clip. Alright, I gotta warm up first, but. Um, <laughs> let's chop down this banana tree. Are you kidding? Losing interest? Are you losing interest? You're not losing interest, bro. I know, but uh, at least I put them in a form of resistance so they can prove me wrong. Daniel just projected, what, what Dale actually meant to say is that, hey, I'm losing, I need attention, so I'm gonna use the excuse that other people are losing interest. Hey, and back, back away. All right, hurry up. Yeah. That's what you meant by back away? <laughs> All right, let's just chop this puppy down. I have, have you know it, I've never uh, chopped a banana tree down before. All right. Here he goes, guys.
You might not have to chop that much, you can start pushing too. Oh boy. Here we go. Let me get a, let me get a wide shot. <gasps> oh, right on the bananas. Took the hardest hit. You would think it'd be a little softer on the bananas. Well, they're green. That looks like some good bananas. Yeah, now allegedly this will decompose into the ground and provide nutrients. Let me do this part. All right. We'll switch it up. Give that to Diana. Let me hear your heartbeat. Boom, boom. What's up? Three. I'll take two. See, so I have to say it quietly. Diana doesn't make food for me yet. See, Timothy has a, a slightly less experience with machete than I do. One chop stop on this plate. <laughs> Oh, I was close. I was close. Two chops. That's a lot of banana juice, though. Yeah, let me see you hold that bananas up. Show us. Apparently, I think that can get rid of staph infection. How many pounds of food is that right there, Daniel? Oh, it's gorilla strength. Gorilla How many is that? Melt. How much did that cost you? Uh, I would guess that's 50 pounds. How much did that cost? You cut all the bananas in half, bro. I didn't cut all of them in half. Look how many you cut in half. Did I do that? I had a feeling you were going to do that. Are you sure I did that or you did it? Uh, how would I have done that? <laughs> you. Hey, a third for it, a third for the earth. None of those has been. You gotta cut all those bananas off now. A third for the earth, a third for you, <clears throat> and a third for mother, and a mm. third for the ants. I gotta say, I'm a little disappointed about that, but we'll. Uh, I guess we'll <laughs> make it work. All right, cut. Yeah. Go. Those are good, aren't they? I think yeah, so. I just want to, uh, Timothy is right, I chopped some bananas, but the thing is that he, what he my, one of my gifts is being an alchemist and converting stumbling blocks into stepping stones, obstacles and opportunities, problems into challenges, things like this into gifts. And it is a gift because seriously, now I'm planting banana trees everywhere. This is fertile land. There's seeds in here. So because I was courageous enough to do a chop, we might have that many more banana trees next time we visit. And that's all it cost us. It cost us a few bananas. Otherwise, we'd probably just eat the bananas and poop them in the toilet. But now the seeds are going into the ground. Sing that song from Jordan Walker, Timothy. They just did the apple cider vinegar in the eye, and yeah. look where we were just look where we were just surfing. Boom! Come on, Come on camera autofocus. Oh, look at that! Just got a new uh, submission for the single Krishna tree in March 19th. If you haven't seen that. You better go to singleandchristian.net. Look and how apply. look how cha how fast your mood changes, huh? Yeah, you were like, why do I feel like you're so close to my face? <laughs> I'm getting good audio. <laughs> we're uh, we're professional bloggers. Actually, but what I mean by that is you could describe us as professional bloggers, but we're much more than professional bloggers. If you identify yourself with your function, you might be diluting your true essence which could be much bigger than you think it is. Is she self-conscious holding the camera on yourself in public, Daniel? If, I'm, if I have self-consciousness, I am much more, than, much more than that also, and I just observe my self-consciousness. It's kind of funny. It's extra exciting when you can watch yourself as you're filming yourself and other people are watching you film yourself. And to watch yourself in that moment is a special moment. <laughs> Are we good? Yeah, yeah. Are we on the vlog? Yep. How are you going to turn the vlog on and not tell us from the vlog? <laughs> <laughs> what, what, why? Why? Wow, but did you just hear what Josh just said? 
I used Cal at one point. Cal said that Josh was one of like the Rob Rod's like master retreat student people. But I will say, Rob Rod would never say. Oh, <laughs> Cal, you're on camera. You don't have to use this if you don't want to. But he's, he's making me look bad. Yeah, come on. If you think other people are making you look bad, come on next single and Christian retreat. <laughs> International tribe design. Because we gotta get you past that. We gotta get you past that right away. I'm just had a good idea. Like you made this video just to uh, make me look bad. Look, make you look what? <laughs> I would like to think that I like, want to make this video, if anything, I could catalyze Josh in realizing how good he looks. Absolutely. I'm sure these are special guys. Special guys. I allow myself to feel significant that I'm such a big part of this video. <laughs> In my mind, I think it's transformed uh, uh, looking bad to now looking amazing, which maybe you just helped catalog. I am a bit concerned about the lighting. I'm not sure how any of us look, but uh, he looks a lot better than that, lighting-wise. So, yeah, I think it's great stuff. Great, great material. <laughs> about this camera is, is how it's so sneaky it is. Don't you like how sneaky this camera is? Yeah, it is sneaky. Yeah. It's almost as if people don't realize you're videotaping. It's, so sneaky. Yeah, it's crazy. It's just a palm of the hand. How can we videotape this camera, Timothy? <laughs> <laughs> 